hello guys welcome to my channel so in this video tutorial I am going to show you how you can create register and login using Laravel and MySQL workbench so before getting started make sure to download and install Composer as you can see if I type Composer then space hyphen V I can see my composer version so I, I have already installed the composer so make sure to download and install composer and make sure to download and install git bash and make sure to download and install node.js and VS code for code editor Now as you can see uh, I have created a folder in F drive so just create a folder in any drive let's say in F drive just create a folder called Laravel demo then go inside the folder once you go inside the folder just right click and then open git bash here you must create the Laravel project first so this is the step by step guide so just type here composer then create project then Laravel slash Laravel then the project name is uh, register login I'll give the project name register and login then just press enter this is going to create the project it is going to take, it is going to take some time Okay, now close. 
now you can see the project has been created you can see the register and login now just type in the address bar cnd and the code space dot Now go to your MySQL workbench and create database. I will give the database name register db. And you can see the database has been created. Now go to your VS Code and look for dot env file and you must update the dot env file so as you can see db connection it is given sqlite so we are not going to use sqlite we are going to use mysql so just type my skill and the host is given port is given you just need to change the db database so the database name is register db so username is already given so you just have to give your password so i'm going to give my password now save all now open new terminal Just type composer require laravel slash breeze then space hyphen hyphen def and press enter.
Now type php artisan breeze install Just type blade and no Then type 1 and press enter Now npm install then npm run dev then php partition migrate then php partition serve Now as you can see the login and register. So first you are going to register first, click on register. So I'll just give a name. Say Michael email I'll give admin one two three at email dot com and give a password I'll give the password SA one two three four five six say one two three four five six and click on register so now you can see the name and login so I'm going to log out and login with the email and password so it is already saved I guess SA123456 so now if I go to my MySQL workbench then I can see the database and 
and users so now I can see the name and email 